<laughs> okay, someone edited it. Yeah. Now, I have a Wikipedia page, which will last two seconds. Do you really? Bruno is Bruno is a well-known English two commentator. No. Accurate. I'm, I'm going re to report that for an accuracy. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Wikipedia page, yay, we did it, Twitch uh, You're the first uh, person in this house to have a, to have a Wikipedia page. Legitimately or not, it doesn't matter. Right, it doesn't matter. Yeah. No, Suja, that's the thing. Oh, the second person. That's how it all started. I was like, Suja, what am I doing? Hey! I looked like he had something to say. Me? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. sorry. I, I thought you you let you let in like you had. Oh no, I'm sorry. I was going to lean in to you know. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 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 Well, but Tivan saw it. See how much it's lagging. That's now the price is getting. Why are the US service so bad? Because we had this earlier with the podcast. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Ten euros. Wait until like we get the South East Asian service. Oh, when we get South East Asia, it's going to be insane. Yeah. I think China's going to be worse. Do you know what I think it's bad, genuinely, is that they have a lot of problems with the internet in America, and Andy might be able to confirm this. But when you get different providers in America, when you have to go between A and B, and you go across different providers, they will scan that traffic and say, wait, you're coming from provider X and we're provider what Y, so we're going to root you horribly, which is why sometimes yeah, they do that. They, it's true. Yeah. So like if you're using YouTube and you're having to root through certain servers, your YouTube will lag or whatever because of the way it's that, And that's why US servers are kind of I, I, get, I mean, I'm just, I'm just yeah, spitballing here, Shiva. But that's <laughs> like kind of horrible. Yeah. Well, why do they do that? Why do they check so much? Because we're dumb as hell. Because they had this thing where they said, okay, we're going to make sure that, like, we, we have these, like, you're going to own this. Oh, that's the next bike. You're going to They're going to fucking read it. Oh, they are, aren't they? No, maybe. The other thing, too, to keep in mind is, like, when, like, the internet in the US in general, like, so we put in a shitload of telephone leaving. lines, like that's a shitload. So now it's like when we have to put in things like Google Fiber, we have to undo everything that we already did. Having a, like the game so it's actually, cost a shitload. We had at zero minute, we had actually the end game lag, so we thought, oh, five minute GG, but it looks like we're going to have a remake. My hero almost ran at a tower. What are they saying? They're lagging like They're lagging like crazy. You know what's funny? I've had this a bit recently, like certain patches come out, and it all goes to shit. Like I had a game, I had a couple of games. Everything else is running fine. I've done a net speed test; it's running fine. But the game lags so hard that it's just—it's like a slide. It's like it's, I don't know what the fuck. Package drop from shit. Package loss. The admin just left the game. Yeah, but it can be. But my ping is like fine. Yeah. But it's like the packet loss. Sometimes you get like really bad service, so you get package loss too. Yeah, yeah. We get that to USD sometimes. Like we have like 115 ping to USD. Right. But sometimes you just get like 70% package loss, so you can't do it. Yeah. Mad, isn't it? It's really annoying. Yeah, but five minutes of gameplay with the first blood already spilled, how are you going to remake that with being proper? You can reload the game. Yeah, from four minutes. Two yeah, minute intervals. So you play until like, I guess, six minutes or something? Doesn't the admin need, need it, like, didn't the admin need to be in the game for the whole thing then? They are in the game. The admin left. Oh, did he? Or at least he disconnected okay. before the that first That page is bigger now. <laughs> what have they added? Bruno Statsman Kalucci. Oh, wow. God, these guys are quick. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. He currently works at the Gishidu with James Too Good Harding, Shane Bald Boy, oh man, <laughs> Andy Draskel Stars. Call me known by the nickname Statsman Bruno. He loves Sing Sing and Maradona and is a huge hit with the ladies. He's been playing Dota since version 6.2, which came out in late 2005. That's correct. And they've got fucking references. His interest for statistics in the competitive scene was sparkle. At the International Tech mm -hmm. Level, which he attended oh, the whole four oh, days. Boy. You're an engineer and run a software consultancy business, but you decided to sell it and take some time off? Yeah. Oh, met Shostakovich, with whom he started talking about creating what would later yeah, become DotaAcademy.com. That's correct. That's correct. This is all from the same source. Wow. Probably. That's a chance. No, that's, 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 that's a Skype thing, I think. Yeah, like Facebook.
Leaves to stole <laughs> Kermit January 2013. Favorite color is green? I might have said that once. Favorite food is empanadas? Yes. See? Which Bruno, I will make. Bruno on his favorite cheese. Apparently Sardo we're cheese. Have to do taco Unfortunately, well. it's a bit rare it's outside Argentina, but it's somewhere, it's somewhere like Parmigiano. Very rich, I'm good for grating, ages well. Yeah. <laughs> That's really accurate. Yeah. That's incredible. Yeah. Hold your ass down. There you go. Much yeah, love for Bruno. Yeah, shout out to whoever did yeah. this. Kappa Kipo was the name of the person who ever did it. Jimmy Wales, I'm going to find all the Wikipedia Next Wikipedia page. I hope that it's not taken down.